Welcome to my Dead C++ timetable. If I enter any value there, and that's what you see. So the next thing I will do right now is to take you guys into the C++ development environment and you see how I put together this code. So let's go into Dev C++. Hi, this is uh, Dev C++ uh, timetable tutorial. I will first of all import or include the IO spring then um, I will also include let me include the standard library as well then uh, using namespace and standard and the next thing is let me declare my main function that's my main function right there and enter my coily braces then enter integer then i and integer j so i will now set the color that's the color system system color the color for my page i want it to be white white is f and three three would be a little bit darker so that you guys can read it then the next thing I will do is let me get the C out to output the following that sign for tab enter a number to multiply okay and column and let me add uh, that's supposed to be for a new line another end line right there I do need a end space mark there okay so let's say C in C in J that would be for J the next thing is let's enter a loop for I equals 1 and I this either I use less than and equals to 12 or I can just say I less than 13 and then I increment I plus plus now my statement will start there I'll say um, C out C out let's enter another tab right there close that tab and I want I print out I and then I want I to print this out as the symbol for multiplication then J which is what was entered earlier then I want the equal sign and I will now on the equal sign I will now enter I multiply by whatever was entered right here which is J then right there I'm gonna end it end line let's add another end line just to add a space then uh, what is left is cl close my curly bracket and I need the system to pause or S it will just flash in front of your eyes and you guys will now see what's going on and we now need to return zero and close and that is how you develop a C++ timetable in Dev C++ so let me run this program first of all save it and run it go to file save ours let me just call it uh, more multiply underscore time table save why run this program there's an error here I think here is the error just need to enter one more of those so let me run the program again hopefully all the errors should be gone by now okay I think it's looking good and that's my program right there so it's asking me it's prompting me to enter a 
a number I would like to multiply that's it I would like to multiply eight times table so press enter and just uh, restart it again press F5 running the program right now here we go so let's increase that um, let's check out four times table you guys see that and that is how you develop a multiplication timetable using a dev C++ guys so if you have any need for the codes let me show you the code right here that's the code you guys see that so I'm just gonna call it today and thanks for watching please do subscribe